गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी वेलफेयर डेफिनेशन ऑफ इकोनॉमिक्स व्हाट वेलफेयर डेफिनेशन ऑफ द इकोनॉमिक्स इन द लास्ट क्लास वी ऑलरेडी हैव सीन द मीनिंग एंड डेफिनेशन ऑफ इकोनॉमिक्स द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ द इकोनॉमिक्स एंड डेफिनेशन ऑफ इकोनॉमिक्स हाउ मेनी टाइप ऑफ डेफिनेशन वेल्थ डेफिनेशन मटेरियल वेलफेयर डेफिनेशन स्केयर सिटी डेफिनेशन एंड फोर्थ वन इज ग्रोथ एंड डेवलपमेंट डेफिनेशन ओके फर्स्ट वेल्थ डेफिनेशन ऑलरेडी वी हैव सीन सेकेंड मटेरियल वेलफेयर डेफिनेशन वी आर गोइंग टू सी स्केयर सिटी डेफिनेशन वील सी इन द नेक्स्ट क्लास एंड ग्रोथ एंड डेवलपमेंट डेफिनेशन फोर्थ डेफिनेशन अबाउट द वेल्थ डेफिनेशन ऑफ द इकोनॉमिक्स एडम स्मिथ वॉज द क्रिएटर ऑफ द वेल्थ डेफिनेशन एंड under this definition in his book in 1776 he wrote a book an inquiry into the nature and causes of wealth of nations he gave the definition what economics is the science of wealth means economics dhan ka vigyan hai economics is the science of wealth means economics is talk all, all about the wealth study of wealth material goods only and economics man this is the features of wealth definitions you can see very and you can see and understand in the first video of economics okay <coughs> see welfare definitions welfare definitions is given by professor alfred marshall professor alfred marshall okay in his book a book has written by professor marshall that is principle of economics the name of book is principle of economics book book name is what principle of economics in which year in 1890 in 1890 professor marshall has written a book that's name is principle of economics in the in his book he give the definition of material welfare what he give my dear students see here the professor marshall has said a study economics is a study of a mankind a study is a study of mankind in the ordinary business of life means in the common life in the ordinary business of life it examine it examine that part of individual means it is the study of an individual and social actions which is mostly connected with the attainment and use of material requisites of a well being okay getting you all or means study of ordinary business of life means means this is the one on one side a study of wealth on the other and more important side and part of the study of the man there it is another therefore it is alfred marshall view point what the marshall view point is according to the marshall the man is in the center mean it is the study of human being it is the study of mankind okay see here the features of alfred marshall definition it is a study of mankind means it's it's talk about the man it's talk about the an individual persons what he says economics studies the economic activities of human being economic activities of human being it is it it, it studies the role of man in the creation of wealth means human being cre creates to wealth wealth is not created to human being getting you allar and if we talk about the wealth definition the in the wealth definition what is said economics is the study of wealth but the marshall is saying what economics is the study of mankind it ordinary business of life okay see here every person is study of ordinary business life means every person acts mainly to earn and collect wealth and spends those earning to get the maximum satisfaction okay means uh, every business of ordinary business of life means every person wants to collect more and more money and after collection and after earning that money he want to spend for their satisfaction for their needs getting you all 
ओके मार्सल कॉल्ड दिस एक्टिविटीज दैट ऑर्डिनरी बिजनेस ऑफ लाइफ इकोनॉमिक स्टडीज एंड ऑर्डिनरी मैन हु अर्न्स एंड स्पेंड वेल्थ टू गेट मैक्सिमम सेटिस्फेक्शन इट डजेंट स्टडी इन एक्सट्रॉर्डिनरी मैन लाइक ए साधु और सेंट आई मीन टू से द मार्सल सेड इकोनॉम इकोनॉमिक मैन हु इज कंसेंट्रेटेड अबाउट द वेल्थ हु इज हु इज हु नोज अबाउट द वैल्यू ऑफ वेल्थ विच इज हु आर हैविंग इकोनॉमिक इंटरेस्ट हु आर हैविंग इंटरेस्ट इन द मनी दैट persons will consider under this definitions if we talk about the saint if we talk about the who uh, don't believe in the money th- we will not consider to that type of person under this definition according to marcel okay the next features is the next feature is study of material welfare okay the most important feature of this definition is this that wealth is not considered the fundamental motive behind all economic activities the primary importance is given to human welfare <coughs> the primary importance is given to human welfare money and wealth are simply the means for achieving human welfare okay further economics doesn't study the whole of human welfare but only the welfare which is material type that is called economic welfare getting you all are is that part of social welfare which can be measured in terms of money that is study of non material welfare lies outside the scope of economics okay in short material welfare instead of earning money in the motive behind all economic activity wealth is regarded only a means to achieve this objective getting you all means economics consider all those type of material requisites who are available in the instead of money okay means only that type of things economic will consider for for what we are paying money only that type of things we will consider under economics the first feature is the study of mankind yes it's talk about the only it's human being a study of ordinary business law of life a study a study of ordinary business life means it's talk about the normal course of the business normal course of the business means it's 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 a study about the a sound person sound man who are having the interest in the uh, economic or in the money okay and a study of material welfare means money is the only source for money is the only source the only source for achieving their satisfactions for achieving their welfare for the satisfaction there for the satisfy their needs okay money is the only source and it talk about the only economic things Mater- study of material welfare means it's a talk about the study of material means economic uh, which type of material for what for what we have paid okay we paid for what whatever we have paid for only that type of things uh, economics will consider according to the marshall definition of economics getting you all are hope you all are getting the marshall definition of economics please uh, prepare uh, a copy uh, notes in your copy okay my dear students if you have any problem you can ask me okay for that thank you thank you very much for today